Here's a look outside the Martin Exteriors roof cam. Blue skies and uh, warming up toward 80 degrees. Probably be in the 80s by, 9 by 10 o'clock if you're not already in the 80s. And uh, yeah, could see 90 degrees. Likely will see it a number of locations in northern Illinois today. All right, let's check in with Nicole Haas out in Freeport this morning at the Arts Plaza. Nicole, big music event going on tonight. Yes, it is our premier month of music on Chicago in its 23rd year. So I was just heard you talking about coronation and special dates. So 23 years of music on Chicago. And we are still on Chicago Avenue, but three years ago, we decided to move it to this beautiful space behind me, which is the Freeport Arts Plaza. It's at the corner of Douglas Avenue and Chicago. And so it's right across. You see the library behind me, Union Dairy, the Lincoln Douglas Debate Square. So we're right in that general vicinity a bigger space, a wonderful grassy lawn, great time for family, friends, come out and meet your neighbors if you've been cooped up a little bit. And tonight, doors open at 5 p.m. It's a $5 admission. First band takes the stage at 5.30, and that is Route 66. And at around 8 p.m. will be the headlining act, which is That Girl, which is a regional 70s dance band. So mm. disco, funk, hip hop, rock all that great dance music coming alive right here from the freeport arts plaza we'll be here from 5 30 until 10 doors open at five food trucks on site as well as beverages that you can grab right here on the grounds and if you want to you can even take it throughout freeport because it's a first friday festival district day in downtown freeport all right okay and that uh and you bring your own lawn chairs i assume right We'll have some picnic tables, but we suggest, yeah, bring in a lawn chair or a blanket, something like that. Um, the, you know, we were just talking about the weather and how it's going to get a little warmer. But uh, by about 7 o'clock, you know, we get down around 80 degrees again, which is absolutely perfect, plus a cold beverage, <laughs> um, maybe some ice cream from across the street, and it'll be a fantastic evening. Also, at the other end of Chicago Avenue, there is Seesaw and Sophie Coyote that are performing behind Ward's Bar and Grill, oh. and Alex Gustafson, who's going to be at the Wagner House uh, later this evening as well. So fantastic <laughs> live music all the way up and down uh, Chicago Avenue in downtown Freeport. And lucky number 23 years. We like that number. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right, up next we've got we've got our live music now. We've got to get to our food. Taste of Lena is coming up too. Taste of Lena. So tomorrow uh, it's actually a car show and taste. And they're actually putting in a fashion show and a costume contest <laughs> in the middle of that. Really? Um, okay. Register your cars uh, from 830 to 10. The car show begins at noon. They have um, a fashion show happening about 1230. Costume contest at 140. And then live music and great food throughout the day. That is right there on Main Street in downtown Lena. So find great parking across the railroad tracks there or farther into Lena. Um, it's going to be another fabulous day and a beautiful day to be downtown Lena. What uh, are, are there themes to this, these fashion <laughs> shows and costume contests or just whatever? It is, and I believe it's a 70s theme, so you oh. can take the 70s theme from tonight's music act, roll that right into Saturday. But that you can find more information about the uh, costume contest categories on the Taste of Lena Facebook page. Okay. Is that a new addition this year, those two events? It is. The event itself is about yeah, three years old sure. of recent events. But the costume contest, I believe that is new. That is not something I remember talking about before. <laughs> you would remember. Yeah. <laughs> I would. I would. <laughs> Uh, well, you mentioned it's going to it's going to get the we mentioned it's going to get into the 90s potentially today and again tomorrow. So uh, uh, time to cool off and uh, Freeport's got a splash pad that's going to be open soon here, huh? We do. So that's the other thing directly behind me in that pavilion is where we have tonight's music. But that um, concrete section in front of the pavilion is actually our splash pad. And so today our hours are shortened just a little bit because we don't want to get the sound equipment wet. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll be closing that off about three o'clock today, but it opens at 11. And on every other day of the week, it is open from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. So come out, check it out seven days a week. It's a wonderful spot. I was out here yesterday kind of checking everything out and there were quite a few families how how much better can you get like 
ice cream is across the street. The right. shade of the park is across the street. So come and enjoy the splash pad any other day, um, including today. But just know today that your hour is going to be a little bit shortened. But any other time, 11 a.m. to 8 p.m., great time for all your families and great place to cool down. That's endless hours of entertainment when you're a kid. Oh, exactly. exactly. <laughs> That's the point. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And then farmers markets coming up, too. Farmers markets. So while it gets warmer, you know, we're all excited about having fresh produce, maybe in our own gardens. But if yours haven't started to produce yet, definitely stop to one of our two farmers markets here in Freeport. The Stevenson County Farmers Market is actually right across the street from me in the municipal lot right from where I'm at right now on Douglas Avenue in Chicago. They're open from 8 a.m. to noon. And then the Freeport Farmers Market is on South Street in the parking lot of CVS across from Aldi. And that's open tomorrow morning from 7.30 to 11 a.m. Great variety in both. So either catch one this week and one next week, or if you're really ambitious, try both in one Saturday. But a lot of great crafts, um, of course, produce, plants, all of that type of thing right here in our farmers markets in Freeport. And I trust that's weekly Saturdays and throughout the course of the Every summer. Week. Yeah. Okay. Yep. All yep. Right. All the way through October. So yes, we're happy to have them here and producing right here uh, locally. Got to support the local farmers. And real quick, Nicole, how were the Memorial Day festivities in Freeport? Oh, we were so happy with how many people turned out for the resurgence, the return of the Memorial Day parade in downtown Freeport. Had a fantastic number of floats, the people who came out to enjoy, and I'm sure left with more than candy than what they were probably <laughs> even bargaining for, um, because everybody was so happy to be back. And of course, it was a beautiful weekend, um, as well as all of the soldiers and the uh, memorials, all of the uh, reasons of why we celebrate were really exemplified throughout Freeport Stevenson County last weekend. So it was a great time. Well, great. So if people want more information on these events, where, they, where should they go? Music on Chicago, you can find a lot of great information on our Facebook page or on the Music on Chicago page, but always greaterfreeport.com, or you can call our office, 815-233-1350. All, All right. right. It's only another uh, little over an hour until that splash pad is turned on there, Nicole. Take, you know, get ready. I'm working out here all day. I might just happen to trip it up. <laughs> or the ice cream. Yeah. Or the ice cream. Or both. All right. Thank you, Nicole. Thanks, guys. We'll be right back.